Here we are, exclusive filming from the Ramsgate Pleasure Round the site. And what a mess it is too. Absolutely appalling. I've never seen it this close up and it's disgusting. 14 years of blight on our seafront and one of the persons responsible for that blight is this man here. Terence Painter, local estate agent who lent his name and his company and probably invested as well in the development of this site. Well I say to you Terence Painter, you are responsible for bringing the seafront in Ramsgate under a blight, a disgusting blight. It's your actions, your support for SFP Ventures that has led to this mess that's ruined Ramsgate seafront for well over 14 years. You should be ashamed of yourself, Terence Painter, for what you've done to Ramsgate seafront. But it doesn't have to be like that. This is a fantastic massive seven acre area. It looks absolutely disgusting now, but with some thought, with some planning, this could be a really big central feature of Ramsgate Seafront. It could be a fantastic leisure area with cafes, with uh, barbecue areas, with places for the kids to play. Maybe one or two, uh, maybe a bandstand, maybe films against the big white wall. All you need is imagination what this could be used for and it could become a real centre point and focus for Ramsgate. That's what it should be. This is one of the most important pieces of land on Thanet Seafront and it should be used imaginatively and for good purpose to bring in tourism, to have entertainment for local people, for people to spend money and have a lot of fun. That's what Pleasure Armour is about, not this derelict bomb site that Terence Painter and SFP Ventures have uh, been messing around with for over 40 years. It's time for the council to get this land back and to start consulting with local people about what they want to see. No more of this council knows best attitude. We need plans and ideas from the bottom upwards to come up with some clever imaginative ideas about what we can do with this fantastically valuable piece of land and what happens here ties in with the pavilion over there it ties in with the arbor it ties in with the port of ramsgate it ties in with the tunnels at the back everything is joined up here everything should be joined up in a plan to get our seaside back and working in thanet and this place here is key to it it's a fantastic piece of land doesn't look good now but use your imagination about what this could turn into. That's why I'm so excited, and that's why I'm so downright angry why people like Terence Painter, that's why I'm angry because people like Terence Painter, who just want the bottom line dosh, don't care a damn about what happens on this land. All they want is profit, and if profit means spoiling this beautiful piece of our seafront for 14 years, then that's what they'll do. That is wrong. A stand has got to be taken against SFP Ventures, Terence Painter, and those people supporting this appalling development. They're holding Ramsgate to ransom. They're making a mess of a fantastic piece of seafront property, and, and it's got to be stopped. It's too important to let this go. This could be the area that starts regenerating the economy of Ramsgate. This is where jobs could be created, where money could be spent, where, where Ramsgate could start taking off again. That's how strongly I feel about Pleasure Armour. So come on Thanet Council, get your finger out, take some action. It took a long while for you, for you to even get worried about this place. It was only when petitions were being signed and when you thought you were going to lose your votes that you got off your backsides and did anything. Well, it's not going to go away. It's going to come back and bite you in the bum unless you do something about it now. This is public land. This is council-owned land. The council should get it back and the people should decide what goes here.